These will be great videos for those of you who love minks. They're super cute and gentle animals. Do you wonder how they were raised on a farm? Join us for a quick tour right now. Remember to subscribe to not miss any interesting videos. Mink come in many varieties, ranging from small ones like ferrets, gray ferrets, to large ones like emperor foxes or arctic foxes. Each species has its own requirements of life and nutrition. So creating a suitable environment is essential to help them grow healthy. Raising minks require meticulous study. They must monitor the mink regularly throughout the breeding process. The habitat of the place is the first thing to prepare. Mink need a comfortable and safe living environment to grow. Their breeders will build them special cages. These cages are suitable for the size of minks. In addition, the cages need to be closed and open with enough sun. It is also important to make a mink choice. A mink breeder will select the appropriate breed to raise. There are many different varieties, including red, birch, and gray breeds. The first is diet. Minks are carnivorous and therefore should be given high protein diets from sources such as fish, poultry, and industrial feed to them. The plant will process the meat for the mink, then move to the mink farm from early morning. Breeders will use specially designed vehicles that deliver food to the mink. They'll share every mink's diet. The food is left on top of the cage. The mink will eat it from above. There is also a need for regular cleaning. Even though mink farms are large and long, but don't worry, the breeder will use specialized vehicles for the cleaning of the cages. In addition, workers have mink waste disposal systems. This helps the habitat of the mink to be more secure. It's so professional. Ensuring good health for mink is the most important thing. Mink breeders should monitor the health of the animals during breeding ensure adequate vaccination and periodic medical examinations to prevent common diseases. The mink is periodically checked for health and is recorded for indicators of need. This allows breeders to cure mink in a timely manner and prevent further spread. It's quite a detailed process. When raising minks, breeders need to create fertile conditions for them. Mink usually breed in late winter and early spring. First, they need to provide an appropriate environment for mating and pregnancy. This may include the separation of the female pair for a certain period of time and providing a warm and safe environment for the young. Did you know that minks are the kind of animals that make babies? Caring for the mink is important. Breeders need regular monitoring of the growth process. Check the indicators every day to make sure they are well developed. After a period of care, the mink will reach a required size and be ready to carry through the factory. The person involved using CO2 to make them unconscious and painless during lethal injections. 
They're going to use devices they've designed to do this. The mink would then be arranged onto the vehicle and moved to the factory. The first job in the factory is that the mink will be skinned. The factory workers then clean the mink skin to remove unnecessary impurities. The mink skin is treated with chemical or physical methods to remove the epidermis and produce a final product of high flexibility. What a complicated process! The worker will wear leather through a process of regeneration to soften and process into final products such as handbags, shoes, or coats. This process requires the ingenuity of the skilled workers to create the finished details and bring elegance to the product. Finally, mink skin products will be quality checked and to market. The finished products are a very complex process. It requires the professionalism of the farm workers and the factory workers. Mink fur is loved by many for its softness and not stomach irritation. Products made from mink fur are very diverse from coats, bags, they bring high aesthetic value. What a delight! How do you feel about the mink fur breeding and production process? This has to be an interesting video for you. The mink is a great animal. Do you feel that way? Please express your feelings via the comment below. Don't forget to share it with your friends. Press like and subscribe to the channel to follow us in other interesting videos. See you later! Thank you all for watching this video and welcome to the new viewers of N7 Discovery Channel. Please continue to accompany us to explore the fascinating world of agricultural technology. We're committed to providing quality and creative videos that help you better understand the fields of agriculture, livestock, and processing technology. Do not hesitate to share and subscribe to the channel. We appreciate all the support and look forward to seeing you again in the next video. Thank you and see you again.